Are profits up on the latest NiceAsh Miner update? Well, let's find out. Shane here, Crypto Fish YouTube channel. So today we're going to look into the latest Nice Hash Miner update, see whether the profits are up or down. And also it's the enter to win video for this week's Bitcoin Friday. So stay tuned on how you can enter my weekly free Bitcoin giveaway. If this is your first time here, please consider subscribing, clicking that notification bell. And if you like this kind of content, hammer those likes. Let's get into it. All right, so NiceHash has been one of the top miners here, at least in my Miner Cup series. I've done two of them now, and it's won both times. If you guys don't know what my Miner Cup series is, link should be popping up here shortly to check that out, and it'll also be in the end of this video. It's basically where I take the profit switching miners, some of the top ones out there, like a NiceHash, BetterHash, Kudo Miner, not, not so much Honey Miner anymore, but things like that, profit switching miners, and I battle them head to head. And nice ass always seems to come out on top. I'm going to be doing a new Miner Cup series here, which will be Miner Cup number three coming up here shortly. So be sure you subscribe for that so you can see who actually wins the best profit switching miner series. But in this video, I'm going to be checking out just the latest version of nice hash and see whether the profits are better or worse than previous versions. All right, so here we are on the nice hash miner update page. All these links will be down below, so you don't have to worry about looking for any of them as usual. So I'm just going to scroll down here a little bit. This is the same thing that's on the actual GitHub version 1.9.2.19 recommended latest version released December 2nd. As of making this video, it is the 9th, so a little over a week ago. So the main changes I wanted to point out here that they added XM rig as a pre-installed miner plugin for random X Monero. Of course, random X is the new algorithm for Monero. If you guys missed that video, that should be popping up here in a second. I did a review of the latest version of random X on Monero and go into the actual profitability of it. Continuing remove XMR stack RX and CPU mining OPT for pre-installed miner plugins. And let's scroll down a little bit. And these are all the actual pre-installed miner plugins. I'm not going to read all of this stuff. But again, this link will be down below if you guys want to check it out. So basically what they did, they added Monero's new algorithm, RandomX, to the actual nice hash miner. And probably did a couple of bug fixes, the typical things that nice hash does when they update their miners. So again, here is their actual GitHub. And you just go ahead and click this right here. At least that's what I did. Real quick before we go on, are any of you using the latest version of NiceHash? If yes, type yes down below. If no, type a no. If you're not, let me know what actual profit switching miner you are using. I'm always interested to know your guys' feedback and I like interacting with you guys and responding. So do that real quick before we move on. put it on my NVIDIA rig. And now I was finally able to get that NVIDIA rig up and running with a new SSD. So it's running perfectly fine. Got plenty of room now. Don't have to worry about running out of memory or room on that rig. And here's the actual rig now with the new desktop and windows installed. So as you can see, nice hash is running right now. Let me go ahead and pull up that folder. I unzipped it, put it in its own folder. As you can see here are all the miners for a minor cup series waiting to be run but that will be for future videos. So again, I downloaded it, put it in this folder, unzipped it, and there it is right there. So once you get into the unzipped folder, you just scroll down and click on the actual nice hash miner. Now it'll do a benchmark, which has actually been getting more and more efficient, so it doesn't take as long. But once that's all done, I think I had 62 different algorithms it had to go through, and it probably took maybe 20, 25 minutes, at least in my case. It might take a little longer for you. Looks like it changed algorithms. So let me scroll down here real quick. It looks like the 1660 Ti and the 1070 Ti's. Let's see what they're actually mining. Looks like they're mining Grin, all three of them. Scroll down a little bit more. 
There's the CPU doing Monero and it's doing about 12 cents right now. So 12, 13 is what it fluctuates around. And the 1066 gig, what are we doing on that? Beam. So with this latest version, profits really aren't up because I usually don't use the actual CPU on this. But since Monero's new algorithm is on there, I enabled the CPU mining on this. So profits are up maybe 12 cents. But as far as previously, they're pretty much right around the same. Now this price will fluctuate from $1.42. I've seen it bump up all the way up to $1.83, but it usually comes down pretty quick. So profits aren't up too much because that CPU actually does probably anywhere eight to 10 cents and now it's doing around 12, 13 cents. So it's not too much, but hey, it is the new version. They have the random X algo on there. So you will make a little bit more money. So it's probably a good idea if you are using NiceHash to go ahead and upgrade to the latest version. All right, so right now let's go ahead and hop over to my website and I'm gonna show you guys how to enter this week's Bitcoin Fridays. All right, so here we are in thecryptofish.com. While you're here, be sure to subscribe to my email list. Just enter your email right there, click subscribe, and you should be good to go. YouTube doesn't always notify you guys out there of my instant to win videos for Bitcoin Fridays. So I go ahead and I send out an email every Wednesday as well, notifying you guys. So I'll do that real quick, takes just a second. Make sure you confirm that email address as well so that you do receive the emails from me going forward. All right, so Bitcoin Friday's giveaway, 12-13-2019. That would be Friday the 13th. So as usual, every week, you're just going to have to answer this question here correctly. There's only one right answer. So once you answer it correctly, you're just going to enter your name, email address. You're going to have to go ahead and confirm that email address. It'll bring you back here, and then you'll have additional ways that you can get more entries into the contest, following me on various social media watching a YouTube video, following me on YouTube, things of that nature. Just gives you a much better chance of winning the contest every week. Don't forget to check out my Minor Cup series or the Random X Monero review I did. Should be popping up here shortly. If you guys have any additional questions or comments, put them down below. I'll be sure to get back to you. If you haven't subscribed yet, please consider subscribing. If you like this video, hammer those likes. And with that, I will see you in the next one, guys. Take care. Bye.